hi everybody welcome back to my channel and in today's video i am gonna be showing you guys how to make a wind win so before you start this video make sure to subscribe like and share and without further ado let's move on with the video the things you'll be needing are a straw any type a bendable or non bendable a pencil with an eraser in the bottom scissors two uh, triangle pieces of paper and uh, a pin like you can use a bobby pin too and finally some clay so let's get started uh, make sure it, it should not be uh, too squishy so anyways first keep your clay in the middle of the plate and then take your pencil and insert it in the middle of the clay and mold it the way you want it to but make sure that it has to stay straight and also uh, make sure that you make it like a tiny volcano and out of that a pencil might be blasting off something like that you know you get what I mean so it just has to be sticking to the plate and it also has to stand straight Now after we're done with that, we need to take the straw and uh, if you have a bendable, I mean unbendable one, then it's fine, you don't have to cut it. But if you have a bendable straw, then you have to cut uh, like the bendable portion. Yep, <laughs> it just flew away. So yeah. And then you're going to be uh, cutting like approximately one centimeter like from the bottom you, it has to be separated into two uh, two pieces of straw but only for one centimeter and we have to do this on both the sides So after that you've got to take your uh, triangle piece of paper and insert it into the you know the cut portion of the straw. We have to do the same thing but both the arrows have to be pointing to one direction. So I'm putting on the second one and make sure uh, you don't glue it, you don't want to glue it. So um, this is how it should look. So it should be pointing to one direction. And then you've got to take your, uh, uh, I mean your pin or your bobby pin. I'm using a boat, uh, pin board pin. So I'll just make a hole in the middle. Of, uh, it, you don't have to measure it but it's your wish if you want it to be perfect but I'm just doing an approximate measuring then I'm so sorry I didn't mention toothpick in the list but you'll be needing a toothpick to make the hole a bit bigger so that uh, it can move easily and you don't want the uh, hole to be too small or else it will be too tight so I will just insert it in and you've got to take it back so it becomes super big. Then you take the other things you've done. I mean this thing. And then you have to uh, place it on top. And then put the pin. So I just placed it on top where I made the hole and now I'm just gonna insert the pin. I, I'm not gonna put it, I'm not gonna insert it fully into the eraser but just a bit. But if you don't have a pencil with eraser then you can also use clay. But it should, uh, it should be moving very uh, loosely like uh, it, the hole has to be very big so that it can move the direction the wind is going to go. So this is called the wind vane and it's used to measure uh, the air 
like the place the direction where the ad is going and hope you like this make sure to subscribe like and share goodbye peace